watching with Anchor Live 5. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if this is your first time here. I have been super busy lately. Um, I have three craft fairs that I'm going to go to um, September, October, and November. So along with my TNs, my traveler's notebooks that I make, I've also been making a whole lot of paper crafts. So I thought I'd share a few with you. Okay, these right here are plain composition books and I actually got these at Target the other day and they were in the clearance back um, back in the clearance and they were five for a dollar twenty yeah so I picked up two packs so ten composition books for two dollars and twenty cents and all I did with these was I took some Halloween paper put some washi right here this right here is just the the regular um, binding of the composition book. I put these googly eyes on the front, put paper and made a little pocket right here on the inside and I did the same with the back and there we go we have a altered composition book that will definitely sell for more than five for a dollar. Same thing here this is just washi from the Target dollar spot paper, a little paper clip from the Target dollar spot and these adorable googly eyes I got those at Target too and I covered the inside and that's it I might do a tutorial on how to do those because those are so super easy here's two for Christmas the exact same thing um, oh, upside down I um, covered it up with um, Christmas paper put a gold strip there's the inside and the outside so super easy to do and they are so cute these would make great gifts for somebody where is it there we go there we go so I have made um, everything I'm doing here is uh, Christmas and Halloween um, and then I have made a lot of paper clips now these are already bundled up ready to sell so I hope that you can see them um, there is a this is just felt pumpkin on a paper clip um, and these are just scraps right here that I had left over from making the um, composition books same thing this is just an acorn a felt acorn sticker and a sticker on a paper clip um, this is just a little wood piece that I got at Hobby Lobby and this is a little felt sticker owl and another one and these bags I also got at Hobby Lobby super cheap I think they were like two bucks for a ton of them another big pumpkin and then I took um, clothespins and I put these really cute little felt stickers on them. There's that one and there's that one. And then these are like little metal pieces that I found and I stuck it on a paper clip and those are really, really cute. And um, okay, these are probably my favorite for Halloween that I did. Oh, here's another one of those and okay these are probably my favorite that I did for Halloween okay look at this how cute is that all I did was I took I wish I had the close up so I could show you I took two of the large googly eyes and I glued them right there together and stuck the paper clip look at that how cute is that absolutely adorable so those are all the Halloween ones and I just have a few um, Christmas ones I don't have many um, they haven't really had a lot of their Christmas stuff out yet but there's little penguins and these are just stickers and most of these are all double-sided and look how cute that is a little gingerbread um, and then what I've also been making is I got this the We Are Memory Keepers envelope punch board and oh my gosh, the things that you can do with this 
if you find one get it if you don't have one run out and get it this thing does so many things and I'm absolutely in love with it so with the envelope punch board I have made adorable note cards envelopes and note cards um, here we'll take one out real quick and show you I can see it back in so this is all with the envelope punch board and look how cute that is it has the little note card inside of it so cute so easy to do so I have made a ton of these and what I did was I bundled them up in fives and put this really cute little ribbon that I actually got um, with my Michaels grab bags um, and so there are those and then I also made Halloween ones how cute there's just some different patterns here like I said these are all bundled up in fives also and this is ribbon that I got from my Michaels grab bag they are so stinking adorable little candy corn and then with a note card inside of it and I purposefully didn't make them match because I thought they were a lot cuter um, just with coordinating paper and then I'm really gonna have to do a tutorial because with the scraps that you have left over from using a 12 by 12 paper pad um, this is what I was able to do so with a 12 by 12 piece of paper you make one envelope one note card and um, these cute 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 paper bows that I have made using the scraps and the envelope punch board so easy to do look how adorable these are and I just sent with some of them I put um, a piece of paper in the middle and other ones I stuck a little gem embellishment bundled them up in a little bag this is also the scraps from the 12 by 12 paper pad and look at that and then I put my little stamp on the back those are Halloween and here are the Christmas ones and I have been making bows like crazy they are just so cute and so simple simple and I think that these are going to fly off of my table at the craft fairs so there we go if y'all would like to see a tutorial on how I made um, these paper bows just let me know in the comments down below and I'd be happy to do that um, also with these so super simple and with this all of this so easy and you are totally going to make your money back tenfold at a craft fair so there we go guys I hope you enjoyed this um, until next time see you soon bye